I can't confess to have written all of these lines. Some of you may recognize them. They were written by another fabulous mid 30 something woman. Mm. And for those of you who do recognize them, I apologize that I am not a sexy yet troubled Catholic priest. <laughs> <laughs> so, love is awful. It's awful. It's painful. It's frightening. It makes you doubt yourself, judge yourself, distance yourself from the other people in your life. It makes you selfish. It makes you creepy. It makes you obsessed with your hair. <laughs> it makes, makes you cruel, makes you say and do things you never thought you would do. It's all any of us want. And it's hell when we get there. So no wonder it's something we don't want to do on our own. I was taught if we were born with love, then life is about choosing the right place to put it. People talk about this a lot, feeling right. When it feels right, it's easy. But I'm not sure that's true. It takes strength to know what's right. And love isn't something that weak people do. Being romantic takes a hell of a lot of hope. I think what they mean is, when you find someone that you love, it feels like hope. So for my brother, with your unique but unwavering integrity, and for my sister, who is both generous and loyal, love, as many of us know, unfortunately, sometimes can be both painful and difficult. But for all of us here today, to witness you place faith in the right place, in each other and in your relationship, we are reminded, love is like hope and it gives us all strength.